One of the most important things when it comes to making videos with your smartphone is having some nice and clear sounding audio. This is very often overlooked by beginners and today we will talk about a solution for this issue. Many people struggle with clean audio because you need an adapter and you need TRS to TRRS adapter and it's all a bit complicated and today we will review the Rode Wireless Me which claims to be a solution for this issue and by the way you can already hear it but now let's get started hey what's up everybody in case you're new here welcome my name is julian i'm the creator of smartphone filmmaking pro and on this channel we talk about making better videos using our smartphone i share tips and tricks and we also review the latest and greatest gear like we're doing today so in case that sounds interesting to you you might consider hitting that subscribe button as i have already said in the intro audio is something that gets very often overlooked by beginners and you know it definitely makes half of the viewing experience try listening to or watching a video with bad audio this is basically impossible the problem when you're using a smartphone and you want to get some clean audio in the past it has been pretty difficult and quite a hassle to get you know a wireless microphone system to work you always had to use an adapter from an iphone for example from the lightning port to a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack then you would have to have the correct adapter Adapters, and oftentimes it was just not working and it was just a hassle. Today we will take a closer look at the Rode Wireless ME. This is this wireless microphone system that I have right here in my hands and this basically solves all the issues that I have just mentioned. So first of all let's take a closer look what you get inside of the box and there you basically get this tiny carrying case and there inside of here you have everything that you will ever need. You get two wireless microphones and I'm saying two wireless microphones because the receiver and also the transmitter both of them have a microphone and you can turn it on or off if you only want to use one microphone or if you want to use both at the same time. Additionally to the microphones itself you also get a USB type C to use USB type C cable you can use that for pretty much all Android phones you get a USB type C to lightning cable that you can use with your iPhone this is also what I have been using in the intro shot of this video and then you also get two normal cables that you can use with your camera and one thing I almost forgot to mention you also get two wind protectors and this is very very helpful when you're shooting outside on a windy day as we're doing right now all right, so now I will show you how you can use this wireless microphone system with your iPhone. It will work exactly the same also with your Android phone, so it won't make any difference to be honest. First of all, what I would recommend is that you download the Rode Central app, because with this app you can basically control whether you want to use both microphones at the same time you can also dial in if you want to use the auto gain mode which is something that's very very handy and also a big benefit of the system so basically that's the first thing that i would do next up you have to turn on both of these microphones and basically there is just one button and you just press it until it lights green and then all you gotta do is you connect it to your iphone i have just used the cable that came with it and then I'm just going into my camera app. So what you can hear and see right now is shot on the iPhone 14 Pro with the front camera and I'm using the Rode Wireless ME. I'm hand holding it. You could also clamp it to your, you know, to your hoodie, to your shirt, whatever that you're wearing. And today it is a pretty windy day so we can actually test like how good is the wind protection working. And just as a comparison, this is what the audio sounds like without having some very heavy wind going on. I have been looking back the footage right now and you know the wind has been very very loud and it was definitely noticeable so the wind protector on the road wireless me or me is not the best one i think when you're using it indoors like i'm doing right now the audio and the sound quality is actually very very amazing but outdoors i gotta admit i was a bit disappointed because it does not add as much you know protection as i would like it to be something that is actually really cool with this system is the auto gain level because you know you just do not have to worry about it and you do not have to you know work around with that it you know in this case when shooting outdoors when it is that windy it might have been a disadvantage so you know you just gotta test it for yourself but overall as you can hear right now the sound quality is actually very very good 
One of the biggest competitors of the Rode Wireless ME is the Comica Audio Vimo C. It's this microphone system right here. I also do have a full review on the channel. When it comes to the price, they are pretty much the same. It does have a few cons compared to the Rode Wireless ME. For example, it does come in a wireless charging case and it does also have two transmitters. We will now make a few comparison shots so that you can hear for yourself like how each of these microphones sounds. So I again have it now plugged into my iPhone 14 Pro. What you can hear right now is again shot on the iPhone 14 Pro and I'm using the Comica Audio Vimo C. One thing that's definitely worse with the Vimo C is that you have to, you know, level everything by yourself and I'm shooting here alone so I cannot see it. So it might be that it's too loud or too quiet. So yeah, that's definitely something that's worse on the Vimo C compared to the Rode Wireless ME. What you can hear right now is shot with the internal audio of the iPhone 14 Pro and you know right now it's not as windy as it was before so there should be less wind noises but of course overall the audio should be less and you know a lot less focused on my voice. To end this video I want to give you my conclusion on the Rode Wireless ME. I think this is a very good microphone system. It does have many pros but also some cons going against it. First of all the feature that is unique to this setup is the auto gain level so it basically levels the audio automatically and if you're inside like I'm doing it right now I can see it on my monitor it's doing a pretty good job and also the sound quality when using it inside I think this is very very good. Good. As you have heard before in this video, outside when it was very, very windy, it definitely has been struggling and there, to be honest, I was a bit disappointed. The second thing that I really like is the ease of use, especially if you're using it with a smartphone. There is no need for any adapters. Basically, you just, you know, plug it in directly with a lightning cable or with a USB type C cable. It recognizes it automatically. It levels the audio levels automatically. So it's very, very simple to use. And that's also a huge benefit. Another thing that's also a huge benefit for me personally is I can plug in my own lav mics because I personally, I'm not the biggest fan of clamping. So a big thing directly onto my shirt and you know just being able to use a lav mic is definitely very very positive for me personally. A few things that I did not like as much you know I have talked about it before when shooting outside I think the wind protector is just not adding lots of protection and overall the sound quality outside like I said, it just was a bit disappointing or I just was expecting more than it delivered. Everything else has been pretty good. I think the battery life of seven hours is plenty enough and overall just the usability and all of that has been really nice. I would have loved to see a charging case like you get with the Comica Audio, for example, but you know, that's just how it is. So would I recommend that you get it for yourself? To be honest, if the ease of use is important for you, if you also want to use your own mics with this wireless microphone system, then of course go for it. I think you cannot do anything wrong with it. But there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you guys have any more questions, make sure to let me know in case you have not seen the video where I am showing you how you can shoot cinematic videos using your Galaxy S23 Ultra, then click this video over there.